The Joint Security Task Team has arrested the assassins who attempted to assassinate General Katumba Wamala early last month. The Deputy Inspector General of Police, Paul Lokech, the main assassin was killed in the scaffold. The shooters on the 1st June of General Katumba and subsequently killing his loved daughter and the driver have been got and they are. The guy who shot and killed the daughter and the driver on the right side and side of the vehicle was called Master. Master is a nickname, but his real names are Hussein Wahab Lubwama. This is Hussein Wahab Lubwama. If you remember, in the footage that I gave you, the guy who was putting on the T-shirt, which was stripped, and moving with a gun, is this guy. When my team zeroed on Master, we got master. And he was trying to fight my forces. And we have put master out of action. Lokech further noted that they will not tolerate anyone that involves themselves in the act of murder. He also narrated how the whole scaffold went down. Nice and get their real names. The rider of Kanabe is called Mudinka. Mudinka is also a nickname. The real name of Mudinka, Mudinka at times is called by his sheikh as Mudinka. But master calls Mudinka Ogema. But the real names of Mudinka is Walusimbi Kamada. This is Walusimbi Kamada. We have this, he was the one riding Kanabe. They, this group shot Katumba from the left. If you reach the scene, you remember there was a narrow place on the scene. This one, I have him in custody now. The guy who took the gun after the shooting, you remember they came to Bukoto and they went towards Oryx. And they came back minus the gun. Was called Kagugube. This is Mohamed Kagugube. We have him as we talk now. We have also arrested another character called Amin, that they took the gun to his place. The gun was taken, ferried in a TV box, a 43, a 42 inch box. But later on, the gun was taken, rubbed in banana leaves to another home of somebody called Mukwas. The real names of Mukwas Because they always use names to disguise themselves with. As I talk now, we are continuing to break the cells of these attackers. The mastermind of all these attacks and the cell in Kampala of ADF is Sheikh Obadia. He's on the run. He's the one who recruited all these people. He could either be here or in Eastern DRC. All these groups are linked to ADF, which are operating in Eastern DRC. He has further promised that the security forces will continue protecting the lives of Ugandans as he revealed that there are some equipment used to make bombs that were found in the home of one of the assassins. So I told you the operations is still continuing to bring to book the attackers, ensure and they punish for their actions. The state organs will do all it takes to ensure that we protect the lives and the property of the people of Uganda. He further called on Ugandans to collaborate with the Uganda police to see to it that all those involved in destabilizing the nation are arrested. In the same line, he passed a message to all those he called the bad guys. The bad guys outside there, you must know, that there is no space to hide, and we shall always get you. General Ketch further quoted a scripture in the Bible. In Matthew chapter five, uh, 5, verse 9, it said, Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. That is to Christians anyway. He also elaborated on why all those arrested hail from the Islamic religion. Just because of the, of the ADF, ADF uh, they, they are in the ADF fraternity. That's how it is. 
you'll never, you'll never join that organization if you're not a Muslim. You can't. Even if you are a Christian, then they must convert you to be a Muslim. Because if you are not a Muslim, then you are not a, you are a non-believer. The question now is, what is the fate of those that were taken to court at the beginning of this week? The guys that we took to cells, after our collaborations of technical intelligence and surveillance, they were in the planning cell of the assassination. But the people executed, it were this. People. Afande Lokech has further clarified on why these assassins attempted to kill General Katumba Wamala together with all those that have been murdered including the former police commander for Kampala Metropolitan Andrew Felix Kawesi, Major Muhammad Chigundu among others. I just come back from, uh, you see, he, 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 he is somebody who has sold you off. So he, be, he becomes a target. General Katumba, you must know that General Katumba was even an IGP one time, he was a CDF one time, he operated in Eastern DRC. Okay, he's a minister of, 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 of works. See, you need to look at that. Kawesi, you must know that Kawesi also handled the cells of ADF in, in, in Kampala. John, John was taking ADF to court. It should be noted that at the beginning of June, the Minister of Transport and Works, General Katumba Wamala, survived an attempted assassination, although his daughter, Brenda Nantongo, and driver Haruna Kayondo did not survive. This story has been compiled by Isa Chigongo for Channel 44 Prime News.